So Worcester has gone through the process of transforming itself from a uh, men's prep school to a co-ed co school. It has dramatically changed the curriculum over the years, I think, for the better. It's a much better school than when I attended it. Uh, I don't know whether I could get in right now, but I'm glad that I don't have to. Worcester Academy is fantastic. I do it a lot of it. Um, I got introduced at the last Visitors Day, so this is my second board of visitors, and I got to know about Worcester Academy, and gave my daughter the chance to choose between Worcester Academy and another high school, and she thinks it's great. Um, she's into the sport, I mean she does cross country, but she loves, but she, she loves the academic classes as well, I guess we're lucky, she's, she's into math, she loves math classes here, um, meeting the other students, kids I guess that are older than her, that works out good, um, but I think she just likes, it's, it feels a little smaller than some of the other high schools, more of a community, more of a family, so she likes that side of it I think as well. Great. Well, I think it's a recognition that this is not an isolated community blocked off from the world, but rather that we need to be connected to the world just the way our students need to be connected to the world to prepare them to succeed in an uncertain and rapidly changing future. The most positive change would be events that unify the student body. Um, so, yeah, I mean, by any student association. I think any time they put on an event, it is working towards the goal of better unifying the school. So there are, of course, examples, and people prefer certain activities, but um, in the long run, I think all of them will contribute to a more whole school. I am an ambassador at this fine institution, exactly. and uh, I am being the friendly face of the school as uh, I walk around and help people out. Okay, I just tried to Glad I could be part of your little uh, video. Yeah. Yeah. I know that the one-to-one uh, -one laptop program has been initiated in a much greater extent since I left, so I'm interested to see how that is playing out so far. You know, this is the fifth year I have uh, done this job. Uh, the uh, I've been asked to give a talk, uh, give what they're calling the keynote. Uh, you always feel a little excitement as you're going to do that, no matter how many times you've done it in the past. So I was 52 years ago. I was the nerd who ran the projectors upstairs for the movies. I'm going to head back up there uh, in order to get some privacy, and I'm going to work on my talk.